All right, you guys. Now, I want to educate this uh, YouTube Karen about boxing because he seems to know nothing about the sport of boxing. All right. This is a guy that have sex with his left hand every single night. He stays up um, lurking in the shadows, stalking, harassing black people that talks about the sport of boxing. That guy. He's claiming that Canelo Alvarez outboxed Jamel Charlo. We all watched the same fight. OK. Canelo Alvarez did not outbox Jamel Charlo. He outmuscled Jamel Charlo. That's what Canelo did. Canelo Alvarez knew that he can hurt Jamel Charlo. He knew that if he was able to take Jamel, Jamel Charlo's best shot, that he was going to walk straight through Jamel Charlo. And then that's exactly what he did. He walked straight through Jamel Charlo. He did not outbox Jamel Charlo. Canelo Alvarez was very flat footed. He looked very slow, but he was strong as you know what? He was very strong. And that's what won him to fight power shots. That's why he loaded up on every single shot because he wanted to knock out Jamel Charlo. He didn't spend too much time outboxing Jamel Charlo because he was trying to knock out Jamel Charlo. Canelo Alvarez is not really a boxer. He's not. He's a great counterpuncher, but he's not a boxer. So he did not outbox Jamel Charlo. He outmuscled Jamel Charlo. You're not going to sit here and make it seem like Canelo Alvarez was the better boxer. He was the better fighter. Big difference. Jamel Charlo, even after losing to Canelo Alvarez, is still a better boxer. Canelo Alvarez tonight was the better fighter. He outmuscled uh, Jamel Charlo. He outmuscled Jamel Charlo because he knew that he had the physical advantages over Jamel Charlo. When have you ever seen Canelo Alvarez fight like that against someone his size? And I'm talking about loading up on every single shot, walking to his opponents with his hands down. Canelo Alvarez, after round seven, round seven or eight, he was walking to Jamel Charlo with his hands down. Why is that? Why didn't he walk to Dimitri Bivol with his hands down? Why didn't he walk to Golovkin with his hands down? Because he respected their power. He knew that he was fighting someone that he was significantly bigger than. He knew that he was pulling up Jamel Charlo two weight classes. That was the whole point of this fight. Because he wanted to knock somebody out. That's why Canelo Alvarez fought Jamel. He fought Jamel to get a knockout. He fought Jamel to prove to the world that he still has his punching power. That's why he fought someone that he was significantly bigger than. That's why he pulled up someone to weight classes. So he didn't need to box someone that he was physically stronger than. Makes no sense. Why are you going to try to outbox someone when you have the physical advantage over that someone? And that's why Canelo Alvarez fought the way he fought. He came out like a bull out of hell, chased Jamel Charlo down throughout the whole entire fight, did not take a break because he knew he had that advantage. So for this guy, this YouTube Karen, to try to sit up here and say, whoa, Canelo looked like the better boxer. He didn't even box. He mauled Jamel Charlo. That's what he did. Mauling and boxing are two different things. And again, even in losing, Jamel's still the better boxer. It's just that Canelo Alvarez was way too much for him.